Good afternoon, first grade. So today we are going to continue to work on our operations, which means we are going to continue to work on adding and subtracting numbers. Okay, so today for our operations activity, we are going to work with a true or false worksheet. Okay, so at the bottom of your worksheet, there is a strip of paper that has all of your addition or subtraction problems. You are going to pull out two crayons, okay? Two crayons that are different colors. So you can pull out a yellow crayon and a pink crayon or a red crayon and a green crayon, as long as they're two different colors. You are going to look through all of the problems at the bottom of the worksheet and you are going to color all of the subtraction problems one color and all of the addition problems another color, okay? So everybody take a minute to go ahead and color your addition and subtraction problems. And now that everybody has all of them colored, you will go ahead and cut them out into individual little strips so they look kind of like this. Okay. And the goal of this activity on our true or false worksheet is one side in one jar we have true on the other side we have the false jar okay so what we're going to do is we're going to go through each little number sentence and if it's true if the number sentence is true it will go in the true jar if it is not true so if it's false it will go in the false jar so for example this first one i pulled up is 10 minus 4 equals 6. Is that number sentence true? Does 10 minus 4 equal 6? If you have 10 and you take away 4, do you have 6 left? You sure do. So that one is true. And you'll glue it under the true jar. The next one is 10 plus 3 equals 12. Okay? So I have 10 and I add 3, 11, 12, 13. Does that equal 12? No, it doesn't. So we're going to put that one under our false jar. And you'll just continue to work through all the little slips on your paper. You should have 16 different slips that have number sentences on them. And you'll continue to work through all of them until you have them all figured out. And then whenever you are done, you will raise your hand and I will come around and I will check to make sure that all your number sentences are on, in the right jar. And then you can grab your glue stick and glue your number sentences into the jar, okay? So this is a great activity to Make sure we all know and are working really hard on our number sentences.